a secret prayer has been heard, confirmed, and answered. A secret prayer has been heard, confirmed, and answered by the Lord. The Lord said, cheer up. Don't worry anymore. Don't cry again. For, this, for your secret prayers that you made haven't gone in vain. They reached heaven. And it's about to happen. Just wait and watch. It's going to happen today. Today. Or tomorrow. But in between today and tomorrow, those secret prayers that you've made are about to manifest in physical. The command has been given for you to receive the answers to your prayers. Your prayers were never interrupted. Your prayers were never resisted. They were never been, they were never been resisted. You prayed at the right time. You prayed for the right things. Your intentions were good. Your, Christ, your, your cry was honest. And God said, indeed, you deserve the result. You deserve the answers. You deserve fulfillment. You are so very much right wherever you are this moment in the spirit. When it comes to your prayers being answered, previously you had prayed. It's some time ago you prayed, but the, those prayers didn't reach hell because there were some interruptions in the spirit. Or perhaps you were really too nervous, you, really, you didn't really focus. And the Lord said, This time around, those prayers are just coming forth. Because you were standing correctly. You were standing right. Because of the pain that you, that you went through. God said it is enough. Enough of the pain. Enough of the time wasted. Enough of the humiliation. Enough of the craving. He said, please just relax and watch how he answers those secret prayers of yours that you made. It's about time that you have rest in the Lord. It's about time that you become so happy and testify. Of his goodness in your life. He was never slow. As some may, 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 may call it slowness. No. Those secret prayers of your sister. Confirming to you this moment. In Matthew uh, 6 or 6. But you when you pray. Go into your room. And when you pray. Shut your door. Pray to your father. Who is in, in a secret place. And your father who sees in secret. Will reward you openly. Some of you have been praying secretly. God saw it. You didn't need to go about complaining. You didn't need to go about some of it. Some at, at a particular point, you never you didn't need to go about seeking for prayers. But you prayed in your heart. Is it prayer of healing? Financial breakthrough? You prayed in groaning? As the Holy Spirit enabled you to pray. And, and when you finish, some of you, by the time that you finished that prayer, you, you, you had a confirmation in your spirit that you had prayed correctly. Sometimes when you pray and you don't pray correctly, you know 
You can feel it. But this prayer that you made, you prayed this prayer and you had confirmation in your spirit that indeed you have prayed well. Indeed your prayer has gone. Indeed, you've, you've, you've done it. You, you could feel that your prayers are answered. There's a prayer that you pray and you, you I had instant confirmation that, listen, this prayer has gone to heaven. And that was what happens to you. When you pray that prayer and you cry it's like that, after that, you had confirmation. The, the, the angels were there to, to inform you in the spirit that you've done well. Yes, you've done well. The Spirit of God confirms bad witness with your spirit that you 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 connected to heaven. You connected to God. And your prayers have been heard. And your answers are forthcoming. Right now as I'm talking to you, someone's receiving answers to their prayers. Give yourself just a few minutes, few hours, one day, those answers are coming to you. Says a lot of hosts, those answers are coming to you. Those answers are coming to you this moment. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. You prayed and you prayed rightly. You cried and your cries were, your, 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 your crying was honest. It was sincere. You were in the right frame of mind, the right time, the right, you were in the right moments. You committed yourself and you poured out. And you had confirmation. Even today, I'm talking to someone. Someone is about to get into that room now and start praying. <laughs> someone is fit right now, the Spirit of God over their life now to start praying. Yes, go ahead now and pray. Cry that, that cry of honesty this moment. For your answers are here. No delay. No delay, no delay. Your answers are here. Go now and pray that prayer. Go now and cry that faithful cry, that sincere cry unto the Lord and have that confirmation and come out of that prayer room. Come out of that prayer time with that testimony. It's going to be instant. You'll receive a call. A call that's going to change your life. You'll receive a message that's going to change your life. A very positive situation that will happen in your in, happen that's going to change your life because of that honest prayer, that honest cry. For God's people shall serve Him in truth and in spirit, and you shall pray in truth and in spirit. And as you stand to pray, believe that what you're asking God for has already been done, has already been given to you. And you shall receive it. And that's what's going on this morning. God bless you so much. I have been Amy Lady. Faith is our vehicle and, and love is our strength. Thank you so much for tuning in and listening. God bless you. Let this message make meaning in your life. Go now and subscribe to, subscribe to our new channel. Thank you so much. Also, I uh, there's a journal in, on, on Amazon. I was assisted by Sir Gloria to, to publish it. It is titled Faith is Our Vehicle. Go into the description box and check it out. Also, thank you so much for those of you who have supported Sir Gloria. Please continue to support. If you, still, if you are still willing to support, God bless you. God bless you. See you in the next video.